just wrapped up an awesome week in Texas. I uh, had fun going around in the tundra and we're heading to Nashville on a pretty long drive ahead of me and uh, I'm excited to see what comes next. Okay, so we are here pulling into Nashville. It's an early morning. Gonna meet up with my buddy Brock, do some fly fishing today to kick off this second part of the journey. Brock is uh, an old friend of mine that I met back in Colorado. Uh, we used to adventure around a little bit and it's been a while since I've got to catch up with him. So it should be fun to see him again and see what we get into. My man. Hey, what's going what's on, going buddy? on? Been way too long. Been a minute. What's up, man? Good to see you. You too. All right, so I think this is where we're gonna be kind of hanging out for the day. A lot okay. of good fishing, a lot of good spots. Uh, we need to get you geared up. Um, yeah. first and then maybe grab some food okay and then we'll have a good day pretty excited yeah perfect awesome you know when I think of Nashville I really don't think too much about fishing but it was cool to kind of get out of the city for a little bit and link up with Brock and just you know get out on the water have some fun uh, see what we can catch or just hang I myself am not a you know an experienced fly fisherman but I do think, you know, Brock and I have some similarities as far as just wanting to get out in nature. and It's kind of therapeutic for me just to take photos wherever I'm at, and I know it's the same for him, and uh, it'll be cool to kind of see him in his element. Photography and fly fishing for me are similar in ways that, you know, it's, it's meditative. Uh, they're both technical. It requires a lot of patience. To me, it's, you know, it's more about the process, and I think the same way in fishing is it's not always about the end result. It's just being out there, uh, the practice, it's cool to link those two together. We might not have ended up with uh, any fish, but uh, I think I got some sweet photos of Brock, you know, in his element, and uh, we ended up having a good time and cooking some good lunch and, you know, just kicking back and hanging. You know, really going from adventure to adventure and I feel like whether it's a road trip or a project or something like that, it's nice to just be able to slow down uh, and enjoy these little pockets and moments um, because I feel like they're much needed and it helps me kind of reset for the next. Well, man, it's been good to hang. Dude, totally, man. Thanks for taking me fishing out there. Yeah. I know we didn't uh, catch much, but it was still a blast. Totally, dude. Where are you heading next? Um, I'm gonna head up to Kentucky actually to the Red River Gorge oh, nice. and uh, meet up spot. with the, uh, another buddy Jamie and he's gonna introduce me to a bunch of climbers and um, yeah it should be sweet so yeah. I've heard it's a great spot. We had a great time checking out Tennessee and all it had to offer and I'm excited to head out to the Red River Gorge to see what's next. But before I do that, I'm going to be making a quick pit stop at uh, Toyota Kentucky in Georgetown. 